today I will discuss uh, with you about HDP formulation that how you will make HDP formulation I will write here one uh, general formulation then I will discuss it okay so you have to use antioxidants anox 1010 antioxidant Anox 168, Zinc, Calcium, Sterate, Oaxis, okay. then Pigments, Pigment Blue, 15, 1, standard okay 0 0.1 1 let's 10 let's say the pigments here I'm using general okay so you can use any concentration okay now you have to calculate this uh, polymer combination you have to check the customer specification what the customer is asking which MFI they are looking for so you have to play let's say I am using here 25 and the rest I will use so 25 this will be 0 25 530 32 42 43 43.2 okay so then the rest you have to use so 56.8 will be LLDP so this total will make 100% okay so now I will discuss with you why we use antioxidant 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 are added to stabilize the process and avoid oxidation okay so we add antioxidant to avoid any oxidation happen uh, in the process in the extrusion okay and also we need to stabilize the process that's why we are using these antioxidants why we use zinc stearate and calcium stearate it is used as a lubricant zinc stearate calcium stearate we are using as a lubricant to give the process uh, smoothness okay for smoothness we are using this to avoid any resistance during the process we are using this uh, uh, zinc thread and calcium thread as a lubricant okay and wax we are using wax because uh, customer they need high dispersion if you are not using wax your product will not be mixed well in the exclusion and what will happen your product will have bad dispersion which will in turn the end product will be damaged especially the film application they need very high dispersion okay so for good dispersion dispersion we add waxes okay now why why I use here the polymer combination 
That's because of uh, MFI. Because when you are receiving from customer different products, you will have different applications, okay? So, based on the application, you will need different MFI polymers. So, you have to play with these polymers to gain that uh, MFI for the end product, okay? So, that's why I use here a uh, combination of uh, low uh, MFI and high MFI polymer, okay? LL, LDP and LLDP, these all are compatible in HDP formulation. Okay, so in HDP, in HDP, these two are compatible. You can use it. Okay, so this is for the HDP. In the next video, we will discuss about uh, uh, PP formulation and also fiber. Uh, formulation okay so until that goodbye and uh, practice on these formulation okay just use pigments of your required color and concentration okay you can play with the pigments as well thank you